doe's. A doe and two yearlings. All right guys, today we're having breakfast for lunch. Got a breakfast skillet from Peak. We're gonna put that on some flour tortillas. A little street verde taco sauce. Sounds good to me. First thing first, let's get this rehydrated. Soak for about 15 minutes and we'll come back to it.
It's a nice, cool, crisp morning. Um, it's Friday. I got about today and tomorrow to get it done, but we've seen a few bucks up in this thick forest, as you can see behind me. But you only get a quick glimpse and a quick second. They're, uh, I believe, well educated deer out here. So it's hard to sneak up on them with the moisture in the air. The ground's super dry. So everything is just like walking on potato chips. But glad to be out here in, the, in our national forest. So here we go. We'll keep trying. All right, guys. I just left my truck. I'm gonna go ahead and Ned's working his way up the road. There's a skid trail off to the side he's going to take. I'm working my way down the road here in about 60 yards. There's a power line road um, that we're going to take. So this road's all nice and groomed and manicured so you can really see deer tracks easily on it. And there's a few tracks crossing, so go up on these power lines the roads and maybe we can catch a deer early this morning crossing and walking around feeding so don't know until you try here we go All right, guys, I'm here with Ned. He uh, just recently bought a fun little outdoor shower produced by Jolka, it's the company. I've currently never heard of it, but uh, it works out pretty good. We uh, got to try it, run it yesterday. And let me turn around and show you real quick. It's just two um, compartments here. This is so... Good. Okay, so this, shower. this, this shower tent is sold separately. And it's just a two compartments. Here's one, and then you got your other door for separating, and this is the actual shower. Pretty simple, pretty straightforward. And then as we come over here, this is the heating device, this hot tap right here. So you got your, in this case, seven gallons of water, field propane, your lines, and then this guy. This guy is the... This is your temperature for hot and cold, and this is the water pressure. And then actually you got a digital readout right here that will tell you the exact temperature. But it's pretty lightweight, it's compact, it's definitely portable, and it's a pretty cool little, little item to have when you're out in the woods and you've hunted for a few days and you're kind of on the smelly side. So everything, the tent, the, the hot tap, the water there to warm that up. It's all about, was it about 500? 700? Well, yeah. This system was 500, but it also comes with the sink. Oh, okay, you know? yeah, yeah. So when you buy the whole sink. And the, the sink's thing, over there, the blue thing. Yeah, so that's a sink, and then all this fits in that one little container. It's a pretty nifty uh, deal. So you can, do your, you can do your dishes with some hot water. And it gets hot quick. It automatically shuts off at 122 degrees, which is smoking hot. So it was nice to take a shower yesterday for sure. All right, guys, we are wrapping up this uh, this video, this content here, this this deer season. Um, it's Friday. We got Saturday, Sunday, but quite honestly, we've hunted hard for the last six days. The deer are just they're still higher in elevation. Um, this tame wildlife sits around 22 to 3,000 here, and they're just not here yet. They, um, we've been spending the last couple days between 45 and 5,500 feet up in mineral, and it's thick up there. It's Lassa National Forest, and there's deer, but it's just, you see glimpses of them. Um, it's, it's tough. It's, it's not the easiest hunting, uh, but they're there. But it's hard, it's hard not seeing them through that brush, and it's just difficult. But they're there. But here in another week or two or three, they'll be trickling down. 
and getting into their winter out land right here when the season's over, of course. So, but it was a good year. It was fun. It was good to get out and have have camp life. So that's what it's all about, camp life. So we love it. We just uh, unfortunately didn't have an opportunity. All right. Uh, take care. Hope your season was awesome. Hope you had a good, successful hunt. If not, like us, I hope you had a great time just camping, enjoying company with friends.